Oh, okay, we can make it. Okay. Okay, we made it to the ship. Okay. This is a good sign. So do I just have to butt ram into here? Okay, the answer is yes. Welcome to the extra stuff I couldn't do because the game was broken. Love that. Love that. But at least we're here. Let's try to get this stuff quickly before things go terribly awry, huh? I'll take the damage. I don't care. Um, you'll probably notice my totals are a little different um, from what you last saw. Don't mind that. I'm just showing off what I couldn't show before. Also, apparently... Oh, no, I can punch that down. I was about to say, there's blocks. Gotta go another way. No, I don't. Boop. I ain't gotta go no way. So I think that might have been the rest of the bananas I was missing. If not, I'll figure out what I was missing some other way. Like the bananas I was missing when you last saw me not being able to complete this level, which was really cool. But all right, here's the last uh, thing I was missing to do with the last banana. That's fun. Fun for all the kitties. Okay, I'm assuming I gotta punch this. Yeah, right in the face. Gotta punch it right in the face. Dang it. Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it. We're good, we're good. Oh, wow. I, I kind of can't believe that worked. I'm just going to keep swinging and hope for the best. Nailed it. All right. The last banana I was missing on this level. Yay. I finally got it. See you on... Whoa. What the heck is going on here? Hello? Uh... Hello? I... Am I drunk? I think I might be drunk. Yo, Chunky, you drunk, man? I think you might be a drunk man. Uh, that was me fast forwarding, just FYI. Okay, so my controls are kind of backwards right now. I don't. Ow. I gotta get out of here alive, man. Ow. Am I gonna make it out of here alive? I don't know. Find out next time. No, I'm just kidding. Find out this time. Oh my god. Okay, I see why. Where the challenge lies. Oh my god, get me out of here, dude. Jeebus. Jeebus. Okay, as I mentioned before, I think... That was all I was missing. The boat better still be going, because I haven't even got the banana. Okay. I gotta get my banana with Donkey or Diddy again. Okay. Well, I guess that was what I missed with uh, Chonky. If I missed anything else, I'll show it, I guess. But uh, otherwise, back to your regularly scheduled uh, episode. Whatever this... Whatever. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Donkey Kong 64. In the last episode, well, we weren't standing out here, we were actually in the middle of a level. We were in the middle of Click Clock Wood, or whatever it was called. I think it was called Fungi Forest. Um, how did we get there again? We gotta, oh yeah, right, it's on the island where we gotta, like, use the hand and barrel or whatever. So let's talk about what happened in the last session, because besides being in the middle of a level and we're, like, at the halfway point of that level and we're gonna work on it, I had issues 100%ing the fourth level, Gloomy Galleon, because the stupid ship wouldn't spawn that I needed to go to with Chunky Kong, I couldn't finish the level. So I couldn't 100% the level, I should say. Also, apparently I've never walked over that again since I replayed the game, and yes, <laughs> we're going to talk about that now. Uh, basically what had happened was, in the US version of this game, the ship can never spawn again if you've left the level and you've gotten the banana on it already, or at least the, the one for Diddy Kong. If you've gotten Diddy Kong's banana that involves that ship, you cannot get the ship to respawn if you leave the level. So, I had to basically replay the entire game to get that to spawn. So, well, you can imagine my persistence most of the time, but yes, I actually took the time to replay the entire game. Luckily, we have the fast forward button. That helped me a lot. You'd think there's a lot of mini games I didn't want to redo, and trust me, there was. But somehow, I pretty much rocked most of them. I would say that even the old school Donkey Kong Arcade thing only took me... I first tried the first part, and then the second part I took like four tries. I kept fucking up on like the... the uh... Actually, I think I fucked up on every level at least one time. But yeah. Um, so yeah, I rocked that. The other Jetpack Arcade game I first tried, because I already practiced that. Um... I'm trying to think of one that any of the ones that actually annoyed me. Not not much. I mean, the only one that really pissed me off again was the where we got to shoot the bananas instead of the Kongs, where it's like impossible, unfair timing. I had to do that again. 
But that was nice. I got that done again as well. So yeah, for this level, Fungi Forest, I, uh, I went back here and I did half the level again already. Hopefully, I've done all those exact same things. I don't think I got any extra bananas I didn't get before. Um, at least the big golden ones. I think I got all the regular colored bananas I got before, I hope. If I missed any or if I got some extras, I guess it doesn't really matter as long as I end up with all of them in the end. Oh, and like I said, off screen I replayed the whole game to get back to the fourth level and clear it out. Um, I'm probably going to have the footage in this video if I haven't already shown it, but just as proof, let's go to... Let's see, how do you go to other levels? Uh, here we go. Here we go. Gloomy Galleon. Okay, you can actually look at all Kongs, but there you go. Boom. Done. I got two Banana Fairies. I got all the Banana Medals. I got the boss fight thing. I got all 5 Hundo Color Bananas and 25 out of 25 Big Golden Bananas. All done. So this level's completed. Again, the footage will be in the video, even if you're not watching it here live on stream. I did record it, just to have it, but yeah. Annoying that I had to restart the whole game. Apparently I didn't pick up these red bananas, but whatever. We'll do that. Uh, well, I guess we could do it right now. There are Kong barrels around here. But anyway, uh, what's up, Flammy? You're feeling a bit down? You'll need to go cheer yourself up, maybe beating someone up in a fighting game. That's what you should do, sir. Take your rage out on a video game. That's the best way, man. That's what I do. Also, someone's grilling outside, and you're smelling a bunch of wood smoke. Is that a good smell? Wood smoke's usually not bad. You're going to go check out that footage later, Omega? I mean, the footage isn't that interesting, to be fair. It's just me doing the missing banana stuff that I couldn't do. Um, it wasn't like it was a challenge or anything. I literally just had to go inside of the damn ship with Chonky. There was a bunch of bananas in there, like green bananas to pick up on the ground. And then there was... Uh, I had to punch these barrels, like time timed punch the barrels to, uh, like, and then the last and the golden banana showed up. Oh, and then and then Chonky got drunk and I had to walk out of there all drunk or whatever, which was kind of funny. But that was about it, really. So yeah, check that out in the video later when you get a chance. <sighs> anyway, wood smoke smells nice, not like house fire, which smells bitter and sad. Indeed, house fire is no bueno. Okay, so anyway, we've done, like, the first half of this level, kind of, with, like, the whole daytime side. We have yet to actually hit this switch and make it nighttime yet, though. So we're going to do that right now. We're going to just kick this off with nighttime. Wait, uh, do I have to use, maybe I have to punch that with, uh, or maybe I can shoot it. Let's try shooting it. Shooting works, okay. thought maybe I could run into it with Diddy. Negatory. Alright, let's make it nighttime. And this is the part of the level that makes it feel like it's Click Clock Wood right here. You expect music with music box sounds now that it's nighttime? Let's see. Let's see if this game obliges. Also, apparently I can climb the actual clock. No wonder this is click clock wood. It's actually got a legit clock. Alright, so now that the world is different, um, I say we just go to each area and take a look around. See what I couldn't do during the day. I know there's a bunch of different gates and stuff that were closed during the day, so let's go see what's closed during the night, because I'm sure on the flip side of things, some of this stuff is going to be closed during the during nighttime. Did I get that rainbow hidden? Yes, I did pick up the hidden rainbow coin here again. I, I remembered where it was and I picked it up, so that is already get guided. We're good on that. Okay, so apparently Snide's place is all blocked up. Yeah, I don't remember how many golden bananas I left off with last time on this level in overall. I feel like I have one or two more or one less. So I'm not even sure. I thought I had like 118 or something. I think there was a snide blueprint that I picked up out in the DK Isles area with Tiny that I did not pick up when I originally... My original run. Like, I think it was just one of those big dudes I came across but didn't have uh, Tiny yet. So, no big deal. Alright, so this place is open now. Let's see what's going on in here. Immediately, there is a guitar spot. Let's play it. What do we got? Oh, God. Oh. Uh, are you just here to light the way for me, homie? Hopefully, because it's dark in here. All right. I see a golden banana over there. Uh, I also see red bananas to collect. Am I... I'm going to expect that I don't have to make crazy jumps. I'm just going to walk across this tightrope style. God, it's so hard to not overcompensate on skinny platforms on N64. It just, you jump so fucking far when you turn. It's like, 
Just let that camera do its job. Stay behind you. Hopefully Squawks isn't timed. That would be horrible. This is some Max Payne bullshit? Really? Max Payne has parts like this? We have to go through platforms like this? Like, I get light and dark. Wait, what the hell? Wasn't there a banana there? What happened to the banana? Also, did that actually kill me? Oh, no, okay. It just knocked me to the ground. Wasn't there a red banana there? Am I crazy? Anyway, don't mind me if I use the fast forward button a lot more now. Probably just a rendering bug? Probably. That was weird. It just didn't show up. Maybe I wasn't close enough with the damn light? I don't know. That was... It made me panic and go, what the hell? And then I accidentally ran off the edge. I was not on purpose. I was kind of just trying to turn around. Yeah, what the hell? It doesn't want to spawn? Weird. Weird. Freaking nighttime ass lighting bugs. Gotta love N64 and it's lighting. It's so good, right? Oh my god. Stop it, camera. Stop it. This is a fucking nightmare. It's one strong ass bird. I know, right? He'd be carrying that light like it's nothing. It's also annoying. Fucking squacks over here. Alright, let me see if I can get this red banana without falling. That'd be cool. Just work with me, camera. Be a good boy. Nerve wracking as hell, but at least there's no, like, obstacles, like, in the way. We're literally just working through the dark. Have I seen those Mario 2 albatrosses? What, the ones that can carry Mario or any of the party members on their back across the entire level? You know I have, but has Chet? That's a good question. Okay, I think that's all the red bananas are going to be in here. I'm hoping just the 10. Camera! Or light! Turn this way! Oh my god, I can't see, dude! I seriously cannot see. Turn the fucking light around, bro. Oh my god. Turn the light! Ah, I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. He won't turn around, man. Oh my god, I fell. Son of a bitch! <sighs> anyway, in Max Payne, there's an area where you have to walk on the strips of red wire or something, and the room is dimly lit. Cool. Max Payne has shit like that? Not looking forward to playing that game. But yeah, in, in Super Mario Bros. 2 on the NES, yeah, there's those albatross birds. They can basically carry you across the whole level on their back and not even move a, move a muscle. Squawks, get on, their, get on those albatrosses level, Squawks. You're weak by comparison. Although, to be fair, in previous games, Squawks can carry fucking Donkey Kong. So you know what? Squawks is pretty strong. Let's not lie. Whoa! You can actually hang on the edge. That's nice. Because I was about to fall again. No! Wow, that was, uh... <laughs> something. Alright, camera. Fucking cooperate, please. I just need Squawks' light to cooperate. Just enough so I can get up this damn platform, please. That'd be cool. Holy shit. Why this has to be the first thing I do today, I don't know. But anyway, banana! I get it! Alright. Oh shoot, there's a banana fairy in here too? Alright. Let's take some pics, y'all. Where's she at? Yo, move your bitch ass, bat. Oh, she's like way over there. I can't even see her because of these fucking bats. She's too f oh fuck, I didn't mean to press that button. She's at Nana Ferry for sure. Wow, she's actually in the shot too. I don't even think I can get her to spawn, hold on. Or get her to whatever, you know what I'm trying to say. These bats, man, need to fuck off with my with my face. Ruining my mojo here. I just gotta get it where I can actually see her. There you go, got her. First try. Yeah, let's go. Hell yeah. Get out of here, Nana Ferry. Alright, I don't even know... I don't think that's the first one I got on this level, I think. Anyway, now we can take some chances getting out of here, but I don't care if I fall. Nope. 
Yep, 360 no scope that non a fairy like it was nothing. All right, we out of here. Cool. Okay. So that little challenge is done. Good times. What's up? Alright, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what I can do inside this middle building as well now that it's nighttime. Makes you wonder what's the most disproportionately strong bird in video games? I don't know. That's actually a solid question. I feel like there's probably a tiny ass bird who's carrying around something large in some video game. Sergeant Bird in Spyro 3 comes to mind, but he's not that tiny, and he's not carrying around anything, like, stupid large. But he does carry around some big stuff. Um, I'm sure there's a good example. I mean, Squawks carrying around Donkey is not a bad example. I mean, if you can find something better, better than that, proportion-wise, we can start there. Alright, so how can I get inside here at night? I saw one inside was closed. That's definitely closed. What's open at night, though? Yeah, don't mind me if I press fast forward every once in a while. It's gonna happen. Oh, there's a Diddy switch up here? Did I hit this before? I don't remember if I hit this. What did this do? Okay, I don't know if I actually did that before, but there you go. I don't remember if I did that even on my other... Oh, definitely not. I have not been up here. Okay, so this is new. Some homing shots. I see a a red Nana Nana balloon. Let's grab that. Nailed it. I put this at 80. Good shit. Almost got all of Diddy's stuff already. Well, red red stuff. Okay, so the winch just goes down or the winch can go up. The winch can go down or the winch can go up. Let's go up. Okay, up it's already, it's apparently it's already up all the way. Let's make it go down. Wait, that switch is broken as fuck. You can't use that. That shit's broken, dog. Aw, oh, man. Uh... Do I just shoot the switch then? Uh, I tried to ram it already. But, fucking bat. Huh. Weird. Maybe I gotta knock the winch down first and then pull it back up? I guess so. Well, I don't know how to do that if I don't, if I don't have a down. There must be another way to yank it down and then you gotta pull it back up. I guess we'll come back to this. Unclear. Because this is the winch. Ouchies. What if I, what, you know what? Let me, can Tiny go down there? Maybe Tiny can go down there. Let's let's make ourselves to Tiny Kong and check. In a second, I guess I can finish looking around first. Actually, you know what? Let me go back up here. Double check what was up here, because I only looked at this one spot. Also, didn't I have more music? Uh, wasn't I hold? What didn't I hold more music last time? I might have been up to fifteen last time. That just means I need to visit Candy and upgrade that some more. I also wonder how much more I need to level up to another melon. We only, we've had two melons for so long. Okay, so Lanky needs to come in here and hit this switch. And get those bananas. Also, this is another room I never went in because this is only accessible during the nighttime. Oh, shit. There was more red coins in there. Well then. Sneaky deaky. I guess we're coming back as Lanky. How do I get out of here? Uh, it's so dark in here, man. Is this how I get out? How do I get out of here? The hell? For real? Like, how do I get back out of here? Okay, it was up there. I was like, I forgot how I got in here, now I know how to get back out. It's so dark, I can't see shit. Gotta love that N64 lighting. N64 needs more of these, these peach lights, is what it needs. Alright, anyway, um, okay, so... I could switch to Lanky, or... 
I can try the tiny thing. I feel like the lanky thing might be a better starting point. Because the tiny thing, I'm not sure I can actually do anything with her yet. But lanky, obviously, there's a switch for him, so... God damn it. How do I get out of this water? God damn it. Some lower ledges around here somewhere, damn it. Get me out of here, man! There's actually a TV Tropes page for Blackout Basement? Really? I guess that is a pretty tropey thing. The basement is dark. Uh-huh. It's a basement, alright. It's black as night, yo. Alright, let's get up here. Get the lanky situation underway, shall we? Okay, so there was bananas in this little crevice as well. Ooh, Lanky actually almost has all his bananas on this level. He's pretty close. I probably have a lot more of this level completed than I already than I realize. Right, before we hit the switch, though, grab those and then kerpla. What do we got? What are you doing? Does this have anything to do with the winch or everything to do with summoning bats? Oh boy. Who doesn't love some good bats? Can I just, like, slap some bats? I don't even wanna... I feel like they move around too much. Which means... Hit them with that homing grape, y'all! Nice. Homing grapes for the win. Get some. You got more bats where that came from, or what, bitch? Nope! Easy peasy. Wow, okay. I thought that switch was actually going to do something else, but I'll take a banana. Absolutely. Yeah, see, you can tell by how many ba uh, golden bananas we have with everybody. We're, like, at the halfway point. Everybody's got two. Some people have their blueprint already. So, we're definitely looking good. Although, I think all my blueprints are turned in. So, my blueprint totals are taken into account for this level, anyways, so far. I think I turned in all my... The last thing I did when I stopped playing to get back to where I left off at this point on this save file was making sure I turned in all the blueprints so my totals were correct. Alright, anyway. Okay, so you can't go in that way. So can you not go into the mill during the day, during the night at all? So what you do in there is a daytime thing only? I didn't realize that. I really effed up then. You know what? You know what I noticed during the day when I was playing this? Is that this door right here, or this wall right here is breakable. It has a crack in it. I actually forgot about that. So unless there's a way to go in this way. Hmm. Alright, well let's go tiny real quick and double check there's nothing to do with her at night. And then I guess we'll be down in this little area. We'll go look around in some of the other spots. Tiny! Girl! Whee! Because I don't see an... Oh wait, you know what? There's a crack under the wall here. Is this open during the night? Oh, no, that's block two. Hmm, okay. So, right, I forgot about that crack there. Okay, we need to winch it up so we can get this banana out. Okay. How come I couldn't touch the winch then? That's so annoying. Alright, well, whatever. Let's just go from this area then. Oh, you know what? This this pathway right here was blocked by a, by a fence before. Let's switch to donkey and grab these nanners. Yay. Again, if there's anything I already picked up or didn't pick up on the previous run, hopefully it all... Well, I mean, as long as I 100% this level, obviously, it'll all leave it out. Like, it doesn't matter. If you mix me grab a few random collectibles, I'm sure it's not the end of the world. I definitely got all the same golden bananas. I definitely didn't grab any ones I didn't already have that weren't blueprint related. I just hope I didn't miss any in this level. So I don't think I did, though. Anyway, this... Thornbush area definitely reminds me of ooh hey donkey blueprint guy um this Thornbush area reminds me of that area in uh Banjo's the haunted level what's it called the the haunted house level I'm breaking on the name of that level right now good timing for a for one of these barrels though because we have some tiny balloons to pop or at least one all right dog there you go. Stop missing, noob. 
I'm assuming whatever we need to do in this area with these thorn bush situations has to do with donkey. <laughs> Melons. Do, 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 do. Does these hurt? Oh yes, yes they do. You know, it's like you gotta you gotta test <laughs> you gotta test the test the hot pan to see if it's hot. Out, yep, definitely. Now my fingers blistering. Also, ouchies. I didn't realize those were thorn bushes as well. Dude, stop it! I'm just trying to hit the damn switch, bro. Oh my god, let me hit the switch. Let me hit it. Stop it! Oh my god, can I not stand right on the switch? Wow, okay, uh, let's stop doing that because I'm about to die. Jesus. Good lord. I almost died to the roses. You know what? I'm stupid. You know what it is? There's an invincibility thing right there. There's literally donkey's barrel thing is invincibility. I'm stupid. Don't mind me. I'm just dumb. Anyway, I'm going to switch back to him. I'm just letting him heal because donkey barrel equals free heal. Best thing to come out of this game, besides the rap, is the ooh banana. It is classic. It is classic. Donkey going okay is pretty uh pretty good as well. Ah, oh, fast forward. Everything in this game just takes so long. So glad we had fast forward as a thing. All right, that probably opens up the front door of this place. Makes sense. Is it timed? We can turn that off. Don't waste our crystal cocoa nuts if we don't have to. And let's get inside and see what's up. Let's see what's up. Uh, we have Un Box that I can probably break. Hell yeah. Bananas with its Kong switch inside. Let's go. Okay. That lowered some... some some swingy swings. Oh, great. We, oh, we we're timed to even greater. I don't even know how to get up there yet. Ladder? Uh, 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 hurry. Quickly. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, this seems to be the right way. Hopefully this isn't a bullshit minigame. I'm worried from now on we're going to get bullshit minigames. Like ones that are just going to be stupid annoying. Alright, here we go. What do we got? Ah, another one of these. I just redid this one with, with Chonky not long ago. Now we get to do it again, but this time with Donkey. It's basically the same minigame, just going to be harder, I'm assuming. Oh, God, there's two of them. Oh, God, okay. Get me out of here. All right, uh, not fast forward. Uh, okay. Shake. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. No. Oops. I effed it already. Well, my bad. I pressed the wrong button first. That didn't help. I wasn't paying attention to which row I was on versus which row that other, other, you know, fucking dynamite barrel was on. I'm just going to stay on the inside track. Make one lap around, maybe. No! I wasn't, I wasn't. Man, adding in a second freaking TNT thing. This is rough. Here we go. How long do I got to last? 45 seconds? That's kind of a long time, man. That's asking a lot, man. Alright. We're Gucci for a moment. Do a lap, do a lap, do a lap. Do a lap, do a lap, do a lap. Oh, shit. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No! Damn. <laughs> I might as well just... Take the inevitable, you know. It's hard to watch them both, man. It really is. Kafoom! I went Kafoom, that's for sure. Speaking of Kafoom, funny you bring it up. I uh, I finally got FML's Wind Waker footage from our race three years ago. So I was able to put... Ah, shit, I'm going to die. Oh, I should have went inside. What am I doing? Oh, I fucked up. Damn it. 
I sh I, I'm stupid. I saw that on the top, and I should have went up on the bottom. I don't know why I didn't do that. That was so dumb. Anyway, I finally got FML's Wind Waker footage, and I've been editing it. So we're finally going to have... I'm just going to make it two videos. The last race I did, we did a Super Mario Galaxy 1, and I split it into like 12 videos to make them to make the video shorter. But nowadays, I don't care how long my videos are, really. So i just been making it... Uh, I just put the full five hour fucking VOD together and I was like, whatever. No, don't. Oh my god, why did I do that? No, am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Oh! Woo! That's what you call a shake and bake, baby. Damn, that was nice. That was nice. That was nice. Alright. Oh shit. Go, 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 go! Woo! Thread that needle, baby. Oh no! No! Ah, oh, I was so close. Ah, oh, man. I. Threaded one needle to blow up on the other one. Damn it. <laughs> I was so close that time. This one's tough. Hopefully hopefully there's not a harder version of this. Hopefully this is the hardest one. I'm not going to hold my breath on that, though. For sure. Crap, 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 crap. Damn it. I knew I was going to hit it. Damn. See, when I go too fast, it doesn't really help my case because then the other fuckers uh, can catch up to me. Maybe it's better if I just go fast all the time so I have the advantage. Because if I, if I go fast the whole time, I can watch myself. Meanwhile, I'm watching out for fuck faces, you know? Crap, 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 crap. Okay, we're good. Oh shit, the other guy's gonna be here though. Oh, I didn't realize they were both gonna be on the outside. Ah, they were both there. Damn it. I was excited to get past the first guy, but the second guy, he was on the outside already as well. What a bastard. What a bastard. Right. Now let's see, he's gonna switch outside. Gonna switch outside, he's gonna switch outside. Okay, I need to go all the way. I need to go all the way around before he gets there. Alright, we're good. So we get all the way around. Okay, they're both gonna be on the outside after this. See, this will be nice because they're both on the outside now. I think we'll probably be good actually, as long as I just go to the inside. We'll never get here in time. Hell yeah. Easy. I'm assuming there's gonna be a harder one of those. That wasn't really that bad because you can finagle them to both be in the same lane, and then you're once they get there, you're they're pretty well effed. All right, another golden nana for Dunkin' Dank, Dunkin' Dank. Oh, you know what? I remember what banana I picked up that I thought. Oh wait, maybe I didn't pick this up on screen. Um, already. It was out in DK Isles. There was a switch to hit with a coconut with donkey up on a ledge. You know, like on the Kremlin Isle that's like got the frantic factory on it. There was a switch up there to hit with a coconut. I'm not sure if I actually hit that on screen or not, but I definitely got that banana and I've seen it before, so it wasn't really that crazy to I can I can always go back and show you guys which one it was just in case it matters, if anyone cares. But yeah, if DK Isles ends up hundred percent, you'll know I got it. Let's just leave it at that. All the bananas out there seem to be pretty straightforward. I mean, there's a blueprint one for everybody. There seems to be at least one cage for everybody where you just have to shoot it with a switch. There seems to be at least one instrument spot you have to hit that will unlock just a free banana. Ooh, banana fairy. Nice. And then also, on top of that, there's also usually a couple extra bananas to grab, like either in the areas on the way to a new level or whatever. Anywho, another banana fairy down. That one's point blank. We got her. Good shit. Yeah, I don't mind fast forwarding through a bunch of animations we've already seen. Okay, another banana fairy down. Feeling good about it. I don't know if this game has two banana fairies per level, but what we could do real quick is just go to all Kongs and double check every level has two banana fairies. Oh, you know what other banana fairy I picked up off screen that I thought I got, but I remembered it and I was like, I don't think I ever went back to get this one. Not here in Jungle Japes. But on Angry Aztec, there was a banana fairy. Is she not lit up? I can't tell if she's lit up or if it's just a lighting thing. That's weird. That's weird, right? It's not just me. She's not lit up, right? Maybe I still need to go back and get another banana fairy at Angry Aztec. 
It's possible, actually. She's definitely not lit up. Okay, I'll have to go back there and check, because I thought I got it already, but... There's one... There was one in Tiny Kong's little, uh... Little pyramid part that I had to go back and get that I don't think I did that on screen. Because I saw it when I was replaying the game, and I was like, fuck, I don't think I went back and got this. But I must have not picked up the other angry Aztec one. Well then. I guess I'm gonna have to go back there and pick up that other fairy. I'll do that on my own time. It's a fairy I already got. I... I know it is, because I had already gotten the other fairy on Angry Aztec, but then I forgot to go back and get the one for Tiny Kong. So, it's not a big deal. I'll do that later. I'll do that on my own. I'm not I'm not too pressed to show that. I don't care that much. To go back and get a fairy I already got anyways. I'll do that later. And we're not going to beat the game today, so I'll have, I'll have time to do that on my own. Alright, so anyway. Cool. Um, let's move on to one of the other areas now, shall we? Uh, I think we've cleared out this first section of the level pretty good as good as we can during the night anyways there's still some stuff to do obviously but I'm not sure I can do it at the moment I have to make it daytime again and figure out figure out the whole winch thing I'm not sure what the heck's up with the winch thing maybe now that it's open during the night it'll be open during the day and then and then Diddy will be able to lower the winch like I don't know also these green coins right here why didn't I pick these up What's wrong with you? Why didn't I pick those up? Alright, so this area... Was there anything I couldn't do here yet? I know there was this flower seed spot over here. Can I do anything over here? Like, is this a hole that Tiny can go in or anything? So I know there's a Tiny Kong thing here. Is there a hole for her to go in around here? I didn't see, like, a spot for her over here. Not yet, anyways. I, I feel like whatever we're going to grow in the garden is going to have to do with her. Also, there's bananas on top of there. How do I get on top of there? Can I climb this? I can climb this. Well, then. Time to switch to Tiny real quick. I didn't actually realize I could climb these mushrooms. That is news to me. Well, then. We got some nanners to grab. Let me see if I can get up something up here, too. Mother effer. Alright. One stack of perps. Gotta make sure I note that for the other areas too, because there's definitely areas that have these tall mushies in it. This isn't the only one. God damn. Alright. Well. Glad I checked. But yeah, nothing unique to the nighttime in this area, which is alright, I guess. Also, no big mushy on this side, so just three stacks. Alright. Good stuff. Let's wander back out here, and... Uh, yeah, like, I don't think I climbed these. Hmm. I definitely did not. Alright, well, Area 3 is the one I'm most uh, interested in going back to, because that was the other big, huge area we did. But there was definitely lots of stuff over here. And I know there was definitely a locked door for nighttime over here as well. I want to say it was this door right over here. Any particular Kong I should... Oh, wait. This door looks closed. Okay, maybe this is not the one I thought it was. Or maybe it's some other door open some other way. Also, we should check the top of these mushies that I just talked about. Because we don't know what's up here. This one's got nothing. Love it. Okay, that one's got some film on top of it. I don't need that. Let's see. That was a Diddy barrel so I could fly. Let's see what's up here. More film. That's cool. I swear there was at least one or two doors like that. At least inside of this big building in the middle. I'm just double checking the outside area first. Just double checking the outside. Yeah. Alright. And it was nice to already know what to do in this big ass room next time around because I cleared this room way faster. This is also an area I'm not 100% sure I did grab every banana. So hopefully we did. Like the colorful bananas, not the big ones. Pretty sure I got all the same big gold bananas. Alright, well, let's start climbing up, because I know there was at least one door. 
one door. I don't need all this ammo. Bro, you don't need the ammo. One thing I have not learned how to do is switch between regular and homing ammo. I don't know how to do that. I still don't know how to do that. If somebody knows how to do that, you can let me know. Because I could not figure out what button combination to do that. Load faster, damn it. Jesus. Like, it makes me want to hold down the fast forward button for the whole damn game. So that, I believe, was Tiny's blueprint we got right there. Pretty sure we got everything that was out here already. I don't remember what floor and what Kong may be needed for whatever I'm about to do. But I guess we'll find out. It's hard not to abuse that fast forward button with this slow ass game. Alright, that blueprint I think was Diddy's blueprint. Like, a lot of the main times not to use fast forward is, like, when you're doing anything that's timed. <laughs> Just so you don't waste time, actual time, accidentally by fast forwarding through it. Okay, there's a door there. Oh, you know what? I, I just remembered something else I found off screen in this area. Okay, that door right there was definitely not available before. This door was definitely not here. Okay, green banana's there, first of all. Oh, and here's his thing. Okay, let's go get let's go get Chunky. Here's his blueprint. And there's a balloon out here too. I hope it's his balloon. I didn't check, but we need him anyway, so let's just hope it's his. So I did find oh god. Oh god. That was a terrible jump. Jesus. Okay. Aye, I don't want to fall down though. Um what was I going to say? I was going to say something about, oh, a platform I found in this area off screen. I was like, oh, shoot, I didn't find this before, but I found it accidentally with Diddy when I was flying around. And I was like, oh, there's a platform here that I missed. I'm going to do that again here in a moment since I just remembered it. It didn't have any, like, regular colorful bananas on or anything, but it did have something we needed to do. So we will do it. Anyway, let me work my way up to where we get the Donkey Kong barrel so I can switch to Chunky Boy. Chunky Boy! Huh. I don't remember having to swing across anything on the way up here, but maybe that was there and I just forgot. Come on, how much further up is the top so I can get this damn barrel? What the hell? Where the barrel at, dog? Oh my god, is it all the way at the fucking top? It is. I, I mean, I know it is, but I forgot how far the damn top is. Jeebus. Alright. Alright, Chonky. You're up, homie. Let's see if falling down here is okay. Whoa. What a clutch, what a clutch grab. Winner, winner. Chicken dinner. Love that. Oh god, don't go in, just don't go in the hole to go all the way down. I don't want to go all the way down. I just want to go down to where that platform was, man, that you can swing across to, homeboy. There it is. Alright, let's get this chunky stuff. Let's get him chonked up. He almost has all his color nanas also. This is nice. Very nice. Get it! Oh, Get it! Oh. Just give me your blueprint, dog. Nobody likes you anyways. Thank you. Alright. I'm actually not sure... That might be the last of the blueprints. Uh, the only one I'm not sure I picked up is Lanky's. Because Diddy and Tiny I definitely got in this area. Now I got Chunky. I just picked up DK's earlier. So yeah. Uh... The only one left might be Lanky's, depending on if I didn't get it already. I can check, but I'm not too worried about it right now. We're still we're still exploring the level overall, so it's all good. So anyway, um, other than that, and the other thing, the platform I was talking about earlier, I'm not sure what else might be different at nighttime around here. I'm going to go with maybe not a whole lot. I'm going to climb to the very top again and double check the top of the mushy, this mushy house building thing. 
Make sure there's nothing else that I didn't do up there. That was only open at night. There's not a whole lot up here, I know that. There was a bunch of doors we did already, like two for Lanky, one for Chonky. But I don't know if there was anything else that was nighttime only. I'm just going to double check that. Huh. Was this ladder available? I want to say this ladder wasn't available. What's down here? Oh! Well, here's the platform I was talking about. So this platform, you can actually fly up here with Diddy. I actually landed here accidentally on my own time. I was like, oh, I didn't do this yet. Well, apparently the ladder goes to this. And this was definitely blocked by nighttime before. Like that ladder was not available. Oh god, this might be a tough one with two big boys. Alright. Two big boys coming in hot. Trying to chonk it up. Yeah, this level can be dangerous with two of them because those earthquakes they do will knock you right the fuck off the edge. You do not want that. No sir. Earthquakes are dangerous, everyone. No! See what I said? What did I say? You bitch. Actually, it might be better if I just let them come at me like that. The thing is, they won't do the, they won't do the earthquake if I'm right on top of them. Alright, just another 15 seconds, y'all. Schwitting. First try? Maybe first tried all of those. I think so. I don't remember one I failed on. Alright, so that's done. So there was another thing I could do here nighttime, technically, even though I could have done that in the daytime with Diddy, because I could fly up there. But I don't think there's anything else up here then. Um, I already did this challenge with Chonky. I believe that door opened with Lanky. And this is the door we go back inside. So I think we might be good on this area as well. Because that's the other linky door right there. Yep, that's all, folks. All right, well, I guess I'm done with this big mushy house. Let's get back to the teleporter. So I can just teleport down. Easy peasy. Boop. All right. Oh, yeah, I had to do the minecart level again with the chonky on this level where you jump down into the well. That was fun. Not... Uh, on what? I guess it wasn't that bad, it, since I already knew what was coming. I guess there's nothing on top of these mushies that's worth grabbing either, so... Oh! This is a switch I have to hit with freaking Lanky? Oh my god, I forgot about that, I guess. Well then, we're not done here yet, but this is something I could have done during the daytime, I'm assuming, also. What the hell is going on in here? Let's find out, shall we? Shoot, there's a whole other area of the level, maybe. It's got blue bananas, so we'll just stick with Lanky for now. Let's, let's, let's hop to it. Uh, leave me alone, you skello creme bitch. It's like, I got a weird number of blue bananas, but it looks like this might even us out, maybe? Well, maybe not. That's gonna put us at 92. That's a shitty number. It means there's still at least three single blue bananas hanging out somewhere that I missed. Or haven't gotten yet, whatever. Um, okay. What do we got going on in this area? There's a Kong barrel here if I need it. Well, I immediately see Diddy bananas, so let's just do that. Apparently I also haven't found Teleporter 4. Oh, you know what? I think that leads out back out into the center area. I think so. I think there was a 1, 2, 3, 4 out there. I actually don't remember now. Oh! Well, I was told you I was missing Lanky's blueprint. There it is. I didn't say I was missing it, but I was potentially missing it. But we definitely are, so... Now we can say we found all the blueprints on this level, though. Let's grab that real quick. While we're at it. Come hither, good sir. Boop. Oh. Oh. 
I wonder how many takes it took him to get that right. Oh. Alright, so that's a Diddy music spot. This is a tiny music spot. Was there anything over here? There was more blue bananas. Can there be the three blue bananas I'm missing? That'd be cool. Oh my god, it's another freaking wall that I can't see. That's annoying. It's another wall that doesn't render. Love that. Or maybe it's just not seeable at night, I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> I love those walls that don't render. They're the best. Alright, well, what the heck is this? Something I gotta do with him for sure. I don't even think I need to do this at nighttime, but we're doing it. Oh. Maybe I have to do it during the day. Maybe there's nothing here during the night. Because I didn't do shit. Alright, well that's fun. Okay, well let's do the other stuff first, I guess. Actually, you know what? I don't mind going back to just make it daytime real quick. Although, wait, what's over here? Did I check over here? Okay, there's another Diddy Barrel to fly here. Alright. There's a Diddy Barrel to fly, there's a Diddy Music Spot, and there's a Tiny Music Spot. I don't know if I should make it daytime yet, though. Should I? Whatever. I'll just do these at nighttime. I don't give a shit. Unless it's blocked, what's the point of it? Why, why not? Why not? Start with Tiny, I guess. Because why not? No! Earthquake! Ah, you dick. How many nanas does she have already? Oh, she's at a weird number right now, too. Alright, so we're going to have to go Tiny mode here. Alright, we're up to 75, though. Good even number. I like that. Okay. And Squawks. Oh, it's probably one of these ones where he's, he can't take us unless we're tiny. Yeah. Who do you think I am? Some kind of big-ass bird who can carry a whole calm? Yeah, it's funny because Squawks can carry Donkey in other games, but in this game he can't even carry Tiny. Unless she's actually tiny. What the hell, Squawks? What happened to you? You getting weak in your old age, good sir? Anyway. Alright, pick me up, Squawky. Where are we going? Squawk, hold on tight. Here we go. Okay. There's a nice purple. Oh, shoot. I sh Actually, you know what? I think I can still go in there. Nope, I had to be tiny. Why did I go big mode? That was so dumb. That was the dumbest shit I could have done. I turned big just to see if I should to get those bananas, but that was a waste of time. Thank God we have fast forward. Okay, uh, let me get back up here and do it again. Yay. Hurry up, Squacks. You're too slow. Alright. Oops. Whoa. Alright, what do you got inside? Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Uh, eat some oranges. It's the only way. It does a body good. Right? Oranges? Oh shoot, there's more. Okay, I was gonna say what the heck. Got him. Nice. Easy banana. What the hell is it? Oh, is that the seed? Yo, that might be the seed we need. Let me get the banana first. It almost looks like a damn internal organ, but I guess it's a seed. Like a kidney bean. Oh, we just touch it. Okay. I was like, do I have to pick it up? We just gotta touch it. Alright, so we found the bean just to plant. That's good. I was wondering where we were gonna find that. Good stuff. Planty bean. Ooh, are we gonna build a are we gonna grow a bean stock? It was a bean looking thing. Could be. Could be. Alright, let's go over here and grab Diddy and have him do his things, shall we? Schmitty Kong! Let's do work, homie. 
Um, I think I'll have him hit his instrument spot up first, just cause I want to see what it does, and then I'll fly. Kersplat. Oh, it's an owl, an adorable cartoon ass owl. What's up? Hoot hoot. I don't speak to anyone without wings. Come back when you can fly, hoot hoot. Well, you know what? None of my apes have wings, but Diddy can fly, so maybe I just gotta go fly to him. I'm glad I did it in this order now. Whee! Oops. Missed the barrel entirely. Alright. Yo, what up, owl? You wanna race, homie? I'm here. Hoot, let's see if you can fly through my course of rings around this tree. Hoot, hoot. Oh, God. Woo! Mama. Okay, we're good. We gotta do another one of these ring challenges. Love, love the N64 ring challenges. They're my favorite N64 trope. Can't you... Can't wait for the inevitable funky play Super Mario 64 play. Through. Super Mario? Superman, sorry. Also, some red coins on the middle of the tree there. I saw that shit. Looks like I gotta go a little faster than the last challenge of these I did. The flying is so hard to control, man. Just trying to focus as best I can. Hope not to miss a ring. Oh, come on! No! No! I hit the tree. You motherfucker. Ooh. <sighs> damn tree. I hit the tree so it made me stop flying, damn it. You motherfucker, you. Let's go again. Oh, what the hell? I gotta wake him up again? Oh, what is this ass? The fuck is this ass? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wake up, you fucking owl. I didn't realize your bitch ass woke. Went back to sleep. Punk ass. Yeah, yeah. Love that for me. Okay, and we go again. If you win, maybe they'll show the secret of how many licks it takes to get to the center of the Tootsie Pop. God, I hope so. We've always wondered, because, you know, three? I mean, come on. Who who actually eats it in three? Someone with some broken teeth, that's who. I'll tell you what. And like that's a classic. How old is that commercial? Like the original, I wonder. It's probably hell old. Do they still do Tootsie Pop commercials? That's a solid question, I think. Don't hit that damn branch again. I think it's where I fucked up last time. Come on. At least bonking your head doesn't make you stop flying. Oh shit, did I do it? Hoot. I knew I should have made the course harder, but I suppose you've earned a, you've earned a prize. Hell yeah. Bonana. Oh, come on! He didn't even give me the banana? What a fuck! He made me have to do a challenge for the banana. That's fucked up, homie. 
All right, well, that's all of his red bananas, though, so that's a good start. Or end, or whatever. Good thing. That's booty, man. Oh, we have to do one of these. Okay. Busy Barrel Barrage. Also, yo! It's shoddy. What up, shoddy? Also, ah! They came in hot. Oh, God. They take more than one shot now. That's fun. But anyway, welcome to the stream, shoddy. How you doing? Hope you're doing well, good sir. Always good to see you. Glad you could pop in for a stream. I'm using up all my homing ammo and I don't really want to. Okay, cool. I was like, can I still use my regular nuts when I run out? Thank God. I was about to be very sad. I was about to be a salty peanut. Ah! You do get infinite ammo, Omega. It just didn't give me... It was making me use all my homing ammo for some reason. That was dumb. All right, well, at least it was an easy one, you know, comparatively to other shit I've done. Cool! I love it. Salty peanut, was that supposed to be a pun? I mean, it kind of was, because there was, I mean, salty. There was peanuts involved. You can do two and two, I think. Uh, wait, what am I doing? No, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. I want to grab those red coins, even though I'll never fucking need them. But I'm a... Sucker for some free coins. You never know. There's a spot up here on the tree that's got some red coins on the ground. I don't know if there's any other shit up here on the tree, but definitely want to grab that. Nailed it. Okay. Okay. 